Today I'm going to show you how to set up to Calumet's HD Manager 8 to work with USB version of Wonderbox and Superbox. It's important to note that the majority of this video will be followed along in setting up fuel terminals and you'll see how to add the Wonderbox and the Superbox onto the HDA menu. Before you do that, it's important that you first set up the global parameters for the Wonderbox and the Superbox, which I'll outline at the box here in a moment. The reason you have to do this is because through Wi-Fi and LAN, you can change those parameters, but you can only change those parameters on USB at the box itself. To set up parameters onto Calumet's Wonderbox, the first thing you want to do is enter the back menu by pressing 9 five times on the Wonderbox and then enter. Then you want to scroll down until you see system and refuel options. Under refuel options we're going to set up what identification prompts are going to be asked for. You can ask for both, you can ask for none, driver, or vehicle. So if you want just the driver, just the vehicle, or both, select that there. Then you select whether or not you want to inquire about mileage. Do you want to inquire? Do you want to force it? Do you want to force it to have a certain amount, as in, if it's only been 3,000 miles, you'll put 3,000? Or not inquire? Generally, most people don't use this feature. Do you want to require previous mileage? Yes or no? And then, do you want to require an order number? In our case, we won't. And then you can set the refuel limits for the box. Ours are set to 500 with a 30 minute fuel timer and a one minute timeout. And what that means is that only 500 gallons of liquid can come out at any given transaction. It can only fuel for a maximum of 30 minutes. And once the driver puts in his number, he has one minute to begin fueling before he'll have to put his number in again because it times out. These are the parameters that you'll have to set up on your Wonderbox if you're using a USB system. Today I'm going to show you how to use USB mode and set up the parameters for Tacalum Superbox. Begin by navigating to the settings by selecting one of the top buttons and then selecting the wrench. Then press 9 five times followed by enter. Scroll down until you see menu system, select enter again and then select enter on refuel options. Here's where you're going to determine when your driver or vehicle pulls up what information it's going to request. ID request, you select either both for a driver and vehicle, none, driver or vehicle. In our case we want both the driver and the vehicle to put in a PIN number so we're going to select both. You can also determine if you want an order number, mileage, or the previous mileage. Determine what settings you want to use by selecting enter, selecting what you want, and then selecting enter again. Once those settings are set up, press exit, and you've officially set up the parameters to Calumet Superbox.